first off that that was giving away some right. 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 At that point, as he said, basketball guys were against you. Yeah, they were. Um, man, it felt like deja vu two years ago. We were beating uh, Nets like that in the fourth quarter, and uh, Allen just reminded me of the locker room. That was him that made them shots. Him and uh, Jared Jack had some big shots on us that came back to beat us. What happened? I don't know. I need to go back and I need to go back and look at the film. We gave up way too many threes tonight. Uh, defense let up, and um, you know anybody in the league know you know they say you mess with the game. You know what I mean? And like you said, the basketball guys. That's a, that's a good teaching point. Teach you what? I mean, we know it. You know what I mean? I mean we don't know about now that we're in trouble. Uh, get them guys a lot of credit. They kept fighting. They played hard. They got us. What did you Cause you happen with? Oh, that was crazy. But I'm gonna save my money. I'm gonna save my money. Obviously, you disagree with old oh, Kenny. He must have did something. I don't know. It was loud in there. I couldn't hear. Chris, you've taken many more threes this this year than you did in the past year, and especially yeah. down the stretch. Yeah. Um, how did that become more of your go-to, especially in, in, in those spots late in games this uh, year? I don't know. I don't know. I try to take what they give me. And, uh, they going in, I'm going to shoot them. If not, I'm going to drive it. The coach was talking about the fact that you know seeing them go under screens, it looked like an opportunity for you guys uh, for, for you to do that. Was that a focus to point yeah, you this uh, summer? Yeah, if you go back and watch our game against them last time, they went under screens all night, night so I was wide open. So. Any night, they go on the screen, I'm going to shoot them. You talked about guys not wanting to have two straight losses. And, and now we got three. I know, three. right? I mean, three. But now, three. now I'm going to come in there and say, all right, fellas, we should never have four straight losses. You know, later moment there with Paul Pierce giving him CPR. Yeah, man, my man Pete went up for the dunk. Should have been an and one. Should have been an and one. But I was just happy. I told him I was happy that he ran with me because I had no no intention of trying to shoot the player. It's a pretty play scene right now. With. Huh? You got those three straight games. Yeah. What, what are you seeing as a player? Oh, um, you know, man. That's not working. Uh, we just got to keep the pedal to the metal for 48 minutes. You know, we can't let up. Uh, it's sort of like a front running mentality. You know, we got to change it. You know what I mean? Luckily, it's early in the season, somewhat early, and, and things can change. Uh, we know what we're capable of because we've seen it in the first, I don't know how many games. But, uh, yeah, something like that. But uh, team, teams don't give us their best shot every night. We got to understand it and uh, we got to figure it out. Because you, you play well at one point during that game, and then it I'm all, sorry? you play. You guys were playing great at one point during 18. that game. It was up 18. Yeah. And and and, and I mean, they cut it to like 13, 12, something like that by the fourth quarter, and they cut it down five to. We gave up way too many threes. That's a, uh, something that we like to uh, try to take away from teams. Uh, we let those guys do what they wanted to do all night, and they made us play. What did you like? When it? you looked at the, at the end of this game, you had the fresh legs to hit that shot with 1.8 seconds left in regulation. You were making plays on the defensive end. Taking more threes, leaving you with fresh legs later in games, not just tonight, but throughout the season? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I just try to take whatever's there. You know what I mean? If it's mid range, if it's threes, it's whatever. You know, I still guard a lot of point guards too, so. How much do you feel a war on you some? You guys are losing lead, you're guarding all your guys that attack. I'm cool, I'm cool. I mean, you like, know what uh, I mean? It's a lot, there's a lot going on out there. You, you know, it's funny, for, big, from, you, from, you it's funny for me though. Uh, um, I prepare, you know what I mean? Like, I, I think the reason why I'm able to do that stuff is because I train, I work out for it and stuff like that, you know what I mean? So I, I, f I actually feel better this year than I felt the past two years. I'm, I'm good, regardless. Are you okay, Patrick, attacked the way he did? Yeah, yeah, I did know that. Um, I knew because we played him last time. Uh, I guarded him last time. Uh, but um, shot 34 shots tonight. You know what I mean? And he won. Doesn't matter how many he shot. Like he was in attack all night, and I was good, good enough for him to win. Thanks, guys. I was going to Chris, explain what's going to happen the rest of the game. So you eager to see how you guys will match up with the Cavs and then the Warriors coming up? We got a lot of games before that, man. Well, we got the Cavs next, uh, but it's all about the process, about playing the right way. Uh, no problem.